clothing should make you look good, but really, it needs to make you feel good. It's about feeling good. We have to be positive about who we are and how we look. Dennis Basso has been in business for nearly 40 years, but his passion for fashion began as a child. My mother saved my first sketch. I'm seven years old, and it's a bride done as a stick figure. When I look at it, I think, she saved this. They liked what I was doing. That sketch was the beginning. Dennis went on to attend the Fashion Institute of Technology and got his start in the fur industry, working for someone else while catering to his own clients. One day, a friend called up and said, could we get a fox jacket wholesale? I said, sure. So I went into the boss, the owner. He says, oh, we don't give anyone wholesale. A friend of mine in the industry gave me a jacket. I went to Long Island. I delivered the jacket. It was $300. I came back the next morning. I paid the fellow. She told a friend who told a friend who told a friend who told a friend. And the next thing you know, I was doing the tri-state area. Wow. And then wow. selling hundreds of coats. He quickly went from selling coats to creating his own fashion line. And this is our first premiere collection that we're showing in New York. Dennis caught the attention of fashion icons and since then has been dressing the most notable women, including Diana Ross, Liza Minnelli, Mary J. Blige, Meryl Streep in The Devil Wears Prada, and so many more. And I am still like this. Can I believe that this is happening? It's an accomplishment to see your work displayed in such a way. That's the best part. Over the years, Dennis has challenged himself, for example, by designing bridal gowns and selling millions of pieces of products on QVC. It's special, it's different, it's unique, it's glamorous. The joy for me, and I mean this with all my heart, is to be able to take something inspired from this very high-end Madison Avenue collection and interpret it for thousands of women to wear it from extra, extra small through 5X and be inclusive. What has been the most rewarding part of your career and the most challenging? The most rewarding part, I believe, was when I was accepted into the Council of Fashion Designers of America. That was a big moment. Was it because it was so affirming? Yes. And then when FIT called me and said, we want to give you your doctorate of fine arts, it's a challenging. Staying in business, working hard. I don't want to crunch those numbers. I'm not, that's not what I'm crunching. You want to I'm create. Not, I want to crunch the chiffon. I love and it. The, What's your biggest piece of advice when you have a, a passion? There's no such thing as no. There's no no. Now, maybe the no has to lead to a maybe, which leads to a yes. If you feel it and you're trying, you can get there. I think the trick is also not to ever sit on your laurels, to always feel that you could do better no matter what. Good advice. So I asked Dennis if he ever runs out of ideas. Mm -hmm. He says he is always finding inspiration. And the greatest technological gift for him was cameras on our phones because now he just snaps a pic when mm -hmm. there's inspiration. He and his husband, Michael, are working on their spring summer collection for 2023. You know what else got me? Because, you know, I'm a, you know, I do the mom series, right? And so we asked him, you know, what it was like as a kid. And he talked about how his mother, when he was drawing those sketches and some people would say, go outside and play. She yeah. affirmed him and yes. she allowed him to Good. be himself. Yes. And when you meet adults who say, you know what, back as a kid, they affirmed me. It's just, it's like the stars align. I'm That's like, how yes, it should be. yes. I've worked with him for about 15 years at QVC. I have a line there as well. And he has just always been the person who no isn't even an option. Mm. When someone says no, he's like, oh, it's just a jumping off point. As <laughs> so, and I think Aaron and Kim produced that. Yes, and thank you, Aaron. That's terrific. Beautiful job. That Good you did. stuff. Yeah. Really, really cool. It was nice to be back in person. Yeah. Yes. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.